Welcome to Dynasty Warriors Six Empires Part 2. Today we're going to be talking about the cards. As I said in the last part, cards are one card per officer. And they range between two and six resources. I am to be at your service, my liege. Meaning, my you can't use like one, like one to five cards per strategy session. No. In this particular game, you have to use as many cards as you are allowed to. In short, you can have the six resources. And of course, every January, April, July, and October, you have a council card that you can use, provided you have one or an officer with one. See, I have an officer with new policies. Meaning, at the beginning of the council, I can actually use that card. However, the difference is in this game that council cards and regular cards they have good effects and then again they have side effects like for instance jeer god i hate that card with a passion well i like the card because it's a good way to level up soldiers in your reserve that you're not going to use i shall repay oh excuse me on the battlefield but at the same time i hate that card because sometimes that's the last you may inadvertently use it and that's the last thing you really want to use so what exactly am I gonna get now enough for taking me in I shall repay your Jesus Christ well I got at least one two three officers so far what other card I oh calm before the storm I could use that that's like the best card to have because in this particular game also, at the end of every strategy session, literally at the end of strategy session, whether it's battle or not, the opponent has a chance to attack you. And so long as you aren't using cards to protect yourself, they're going to attack you. One of those cards I just used, which is Calm Before the Storm, will keep them from attacking me. So now I can go on ahead and invade without any problems. But there are some cards that are good for battle, mostly high spirits, which I just got, and um, retainers will definitely one, a good one, because that one also raises your defense. And thick and thin, definitely one of the better ones. Thick and thin and thanks to conquer because they give you extra resources when you use them. And then there are cards that'll help increase the experience because in this particular game you don't have that option whether you go on hard or not because you need cards quite frankly to increase experience and right now I'm showing you that you're going to be able to pick music right after you go through your uh, battle menu and right before you go to battle you can always select your tracks. Understood. So that way, you can pick your song. You can even download songs, which some of them are free. Or that I don't think. No, no, they aren't free. They aren't free. The music isn't free. The costumes are. You can download songs from Xbox Live or PSN. But the PlayStation 2 may be a little bit bone on that category. This base belongs to me. And once again, you have your commands on your control pad. Until we get another uh, Dynasty Warriors game, this will be the last time you'll see it. And what irony, I captured an officer. I mean, I didn't even know I captured this officer, but I captured him. But as I said before, there are two cards in this game that will increase experience. And that is high no, not possible. It's ambition, that's the one. And Dragon's Will. Those two cards will help you gain experience and and make officers drop extra experience. That's what the that's what those cards are for. But even without those cards. 
you'll be gaining experience for getting five, six hundred to over a thousand kills. You'll be getting experiences for capturing bases. You'll get experience from killing off a certain number of officers, keeping up a long, long chain of combos. Man, you'll even get experience for capturing the main base. Oh, but there's also three things you want to worry about as far as battles concerned. At the start of every battle, there are three types of officers that's going to be a pain in the butt, and you'll probably see them through playthrough. The first one is rallying officers. A certain officer will rally their troops at the beginning of the battle, and you gotta take that officer down. And of course, if you do, that'll raise the spirits and at the same time, double the experience. Well, I wouldn't say double the experience points. No way, yeah, it does. You get the experience points dropped, plus they give you experience points for beating the rally officer. Secondly, you've got officers that plan sneak attacks. Now, officers that plan sneak attacks are the dirtiest ones because these officers will go after your supply base and set it on fire. Much like you can set other people. Officers, I mean, enemy officer supply bases on fire as well. But you might want to catch them before they do. Otherwise, it's going to be a very terrible mess. And then there's officers that are acting suspiciously. They will capture every single base you have until you stop them. Or until they take your main camp. They'll set every last one of your bases on fire instead of just setting a supply base on fire. So those are the three officers you need to watch out for. Meanwhile, from the looks of it, all I got is generic officers. I really hope that I actually get a Musa officer for at the very least a female character. Ah, uh, here they go with the strategies. I'll reap every last one of you apart, piece by piece. Just because you are in my way. I like that. This particular weapon is awesome. strategies are useless here. Although I like the Halberd brother better, this one's actually pretty damn good. By the way, the Halberd's with Guan Ping, so... If you want the Halberd, you'll have to have Guan Ping's motion. Anyway... Let's go on ahead and buy that... Oh, we got a lot of gems here! Sweet! So, let's go on ahead and buy that stupid jerk that we just captured. That'll just be more officers for me. Alright, and that means two lands. At this point, I'm going to end it. In the next episode, there's going to be some events that will be happening, so I'll be talking about that too. This is Man 985 I know this has been a short part, but I'll try to squeeze in a couple extra fights here and there. See you guys next time.